The injuries hurt us last year, definitely. Uh, we had a lot of injuries. Defensively, Pat was the biggest loss with his hamstring always uh, being a problem. But uh, Caleb Lee Quinado, you'll see him at center back this year next to Pat. He's a senior, four years experience. Uh, very good, steady defender. On the outside left, we moved Azid Ida that back to uh, left back from out of the midfield. He's done very well for us there, and we're still looking for a right back. We've got a couple guys battling for that spot, so I, defensively, I think we'll be pretty solid. Scotty Douglas was our uh, most prolific scorer the last two or three years. We are going to miss him, but we are. Uh, we have some good recruits coming in, some guys that have scored a lot of goals in high school at a very high level, Division I high schools, Samuel Benagano from Manchester Central, uh, Connor Leahy is back, he's healthy, we didn't have him last year, he's a very good striker, and Eddie Mercer will be up on the forward line this year, we expect some goals from him. Cat was our starter towards the end last year, a lot of experience, um, Mark Keller is a backup right now. I think when Mark gets healthy, it's gonna be a very good battle for that starting position. I think they'll push each other, and uh, I think it'll be very interesting how it ends up. And we also have a third keeper in Jacob Walker. I like our schedule. It's a good, tough schedule. I think we can meet it, meet the demands of the schedule. I think we'll make a good run at the conference. Our guys right now came in very, very fit. We have no one sitting out after three days. Usually you got some guys on the sidelines sitting down. So uh, I think these guys will be ready to, uh, to play. We got some very good teams on the schedule. Gordon's nationally ranked, Brandeis is right up there, Wenick, Wheaton, and then you got your conference games. So uh, we'll meet the demands of the schedule.